Good Saturday, everyone. If you play Worlder or Scrabble, this um, video might be helpful for you to find uh, words using letters. Um, this is a fun uh, video. Um, I'm not recommending you to cheat or anything, but um, you can actually use Power Automate to find uh, the words that you need for your games. So recently, Power Automate just updated their version to include um, a nice uh, window display uh, like this to input your data. And um, you can actually use it to specify the number of characters for the word that you want to find. And then you can fill in all the letters that uh, that is that is in the word. After filling this in, you click on OK. Um, then it will roughly take five minutes. Go through the words in this um, dictionary. It's not dictionary. It's a list of words actually um, that I have downloaded from uh, this website millistrong.com slash wordlist.html I will also put the link in the description below so once you put in your letters right like a b c you run it and after five minutes you will get a report to to, uh, a report of the words right that contains a b and c my name is hao zong i'm here to help you to use office work tools such as excel and power automate if you think my videos are helpful please help me by subscribing to my channel thank you Okay, let me start how to do this. First process, first, first flow that you use is display custom form preview. This is a new um, function uh, that you need to, that is with um, the latest Power Automate desktop version uh, in, uh, in February 2022. They have uh, released this version. So download the latest one and then you will have this display custom form. So what you do is click on it, then go to custom form designer. Alright, we click on preview form. This is this is the form that I showed you earlier in the video. Right, so you need to uh, copy my form structure. So character length is a number input, so you just drag like this, right, and release it. Right, once you release it, right. So my ID here is character length. Then the label is enter number of characters. The label which is will be in your form. Default value is five. If you are, if you are playing Worder, right, um. I set minimum and maximum value to five because um, I'm using it uh, to 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 um, to test on a word. You can actually set your minimum value and maximum value to your uh, to your needs. Right, uh, spacing is default. Um, the rest, the rest, you can leave it as default. Uh, because I'm using it for Worder, so I just put it uh, five letters only as the error message. Next, you use the text input, so you drag it to the main uh, window here, right? Then uh, I have I have made uh, five fields available for user to put in uh, their letters. So first is uh, letter one, so letter to find one. Style text, 
maximum length is one so that um, user can only put one letter right then uh, validation required i just uh, tick on it to determine whether this input is required or not so uh the first letter is required right then second letter right i i uh, i didn't tick required so at least one letter is um uh, is uh is is keyed in by the user right so you change letter to letter to find two then you just control c and control v right it will it will go it will automatically um uh paste a new uh, text view so it's a letter six now id letter six label you need to change to uh, letter six but uh, i only use five letters so this is just a demo let me delete this so you so you just uh do it for five letters so letter three letter four letter five then the next thing is you need to use the submit button right over here id is submit title is okay all right so once you have done this you save Then you save. Next, you read text from file. So you read from the the com concorp lowercase file. Store contents as list. Each is a list item. Variable produces file contents. Then uh, you create a new list, and then the new list name is short list. Then you use for each current item file in the file contents right so you have a lot of if statements here so um, the first if is your current length must be equal to the custom form data uh, then open bracket apostrophe character link apostrophe close bracket and n percent this is actually um this will actually call out your form here so your form here is custom form data right then i was using um character length right as the id so it's custom form data and character length right mm. then you do another if right current item contains custom form data letter one and so on and so forth right two three four five let me open up five letter five you see it's custom form data letter five um and remember to ignore case yeah enable ignore case then you add items add item current item to the short list then you launch excel with a blank document make instant visible then write to excel worksheet excel instance value to write a short list on currently active cell All right so uh, I do a sample run quickly. So five letters. So maybe I want A letter five, letter to five two, letter to five three C. So I'm going to pause here a bit. All right, I'm going to show you this custom form data. This is very important. You can view here, right? Character length is five. Letter one A, letter B, letter two B, letter three C. Letter four is blank because I didn't key in anything. 
Same with letter five, I didn't key in anything. So, so you see to call out this letter one, letter two, and character length is actually um, here, you know, custom form data, open bracket letter two, close bracket. So just remember the apostrophe. So, so I, so I think to, to get faster results, right? You, you close this and run it from your main uh, flow, right? Um, it will only take five minutes for, for me. So I'm not going to run it because I have already shown you the results that I got, which is um, just now in the, in the video, uh, in, uh, earlier in the window. So if you have any questions, please leave a comment below. And uh, if you like this video, please remember to like and subscribe. Thank you so much, guys. I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye. Thank you.